Well, let's see how well this new camera is going to work. It's called a Panasonic DMC TS20. A Lumix series. It's supposed to be waterproof to a depth of about 15 feet. I guess we'll prove that. Once we go snorkeling a little bit later in the season, down in the tropics. I'll get something worthwhile out of this uh, new camera. It's about time I got a new one. See how well it takes under car pictures. Under hood view. Starburst out the side, but Alright, give her a start. Next stop, get a tripod. It's amazing what new cylinder heads will do for a car. Well, what are we up to today? Doing around the car the inspection on the 72 Vista Cruiser. I discovered that the windshield washer pump wasn't working. Everything should be working on a car. You never know, especially with old cars these days in Ontario province, when they're going to be pulling you over to uh, do roadside inspections, and one of the first things they go for is a windshield washer. It would be pretty embarrassing if um, this stupid thing wouldn't have been working. So that's why you got to do these round the car inspections. Make sure your lights are working. Although you can always say that, hey, that light must have just burned out or something like that. But, um, but so anyway, so we're going to be after changing this thing over here. And um, keep my attention on things here. Um, and we're going to change. I was, I was thinking of changing the whole body. But the heck with it. This one's a lot prettier looking. It's all been polished and clear coated. That's the new old stock part. It's not quite as pretty looking. It also has a cracked glass. So I'm just going to take out the rubber pump mechanism and the rubber diaphragm and put that onto this instead. And we'll see what will happen. So again, always do around the car inspection, especially with older cars. You know, they always want to hassle you out there for the silliest things at times. So just take care with the stuff and make sure everything is working on the car and looks decent and keep the car looking clean. And that way they just stay away from you and they don't bother you too much. So. We'll see how this project turns out in a couple of minutes. Take care. Bye.
Well, there's the problem. Found it already. All dried up over here, cracked. It's not holding a seal, it looks like. That's why it wasn't working in the washer. I'm also going to use the much prettier looking screws off of this cover over here. Every day a bitty bit of an improvement on the old car comes along. Well, we'll see how things progress. Well, does anything ever work out easy in life? No. Not even a simple little supposedly... Oh, it's only going to take me two minutes to fix something. Now it looks like the seal inside the cylinder of this old one over here is kind of dried out. See, it looks pretty yuck in there, actually. Here's a new one over here, so we're just going to do a transfer of covers, basically. Put all the new pieces onto this one. Put the non-broken cover onto this piece over here. Try to index it up properly and see if we'll get some su success. You see, I was very optimistic about this working the first time because heaven forbid I should get windshield washer fluid squirting all over the car. Wouldn't want to have that happen. That's just strictly there. Just, well, you never know when you might need it. <laughs> Regardless, we'll see what'll happen. Carry on, we must. Oh, the fun with old cars. Okay, the camera is nice and braced, and we're going to see how the mechanism on these windshield washers work. Well, they're working now. Very happy about that. Finally got it all back together in one piece. You push the button, activates the cam, and away it goes. And it stops once it reaches a certain point. Sometimes when the cams wear, you get a little bit more. I'll keep spinning around until it empties up the ball or I may have to unplug the thing, but that's how it goes all the time until it's just ready to jump into action next time. But anyway, it looks like we've got the stupid thing working, so I'm happy about that. I just can't that gosh off a mess of liquid off of the windshield now. Ugh, it's gonna leave spots otherwise. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.